In this webinar, we would learn the complications and the necessary interventions to avoid them for a baby on CPAP. Any baby on CPAP requires extensive monitoring for complications. The complications are related to nasal injury, air leaks, CPAP belly and hemodynamic instability. Injuries such as columnar notch and columnar transection are prevented by maintaining the distance between the nasal prongs and the columella and by preventing the weight of the CPAP circuit falling onto the nose of the baby. Injuries such as septal damage and flaring of nostrils is prevented by using appropriate size of the prongs and also by ensuring the correct softness of the prongs. Prevention of snubbing is needed to prevent pressure sores and skin injuries. Overall, nasal and nasal septal injury is preventable by careful observation, using correct prong size, appropriate prong fixation and appropriate attachment of prongs to cap and CPAP tubings. Injury to the skin over the upper lip, chin and nose is prevented by frequent observation, minimizing the points of contact, keeping the area clean and dry and by avoiding all topical paints and ointments. Complications such as air leaks sometimes occur in a baby on CPAP. Although poor compliance are gestation or non-modifiable risk factors, flow and pressure used in CPAP are modifiable risk factors to prevent this complication. Nasal injury, skin injury and air leaks are preventable complications of CPAP. Thank you.